all the land, Palestinian land, three area, A, B, C. What mean? Area A, it's under Palestinian control. Like city center Bethlehem, city center Hebron, city center Ramallah, only in area A, only Palestinian. Permission number three, and this is the important permission for us. Permission for work, if we need to go to work in Israeli side. But which work we need to go to work there? Like something is not a professional, something like construction, mm -hmm. like cleaning in the restaurant, cleaning in the hotel, make road. Something is not a professional, I mean like doctors or engineers or nurse or something. This permission for work, the important one, is not for everyone here. First, you need to have wife and kids if you are single, no permission. Because the Israeli thing, if you have wife, if you have kids, you are not terrorist, you are not dangerous, you need to go to work and then you need to back to your family, to your kids. Mm -hmm. Second, you need to be clean in your life. What I mean clean in your life? I mean, you don't go to the jail before, Israeli jail. You don't make any terrorist thing in your life, you don't frost. Israeli settlement, red roof. And you can see the design for the houses is very beautiful, not like our houses, Palestinian house. I tell you how the Israeli built the settlement. Example, what's your name? Miguel. 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 If you are the Jew, if you are Jewish, and you live in Mexico or in USA, and your life in Mexico is very bad life. You are like homeless. You don't have work, you don't have job, you don't have anything. Israeli government from here, she speak with you, she tell you, Miguel, come to live here. I give you house, I give you land, I give you job, I give you salary. Because of that, you can see the Israeli. You need to know something. Anyone, you need to go, example, inside this settlement, everyone inside, he go one gate, from one gate. Because Israeli check, everyone go inside. Because they have built up a terrorist thing, so Palestinian take yellow bar, yellow plate, and he go to make attacks, example. Example like this settlement, you see this gate? Oh, yeah. Everyone, he go inside by this gate, and Israeli open and close, and check all the cars go inside. All the time, scared, scared, scared. For me, for me, I don't like I don't like this life because this life is like only like you scare from me, I scare from you. We drive behind the way to go inside only by this window and by this window. Something you to, to see in your eyes, not just in the media. And if you need to stay here, maybe I don't know, 20 minutes, 30 minutes. Tried to run to move outside, but the Palestinian killed him here before he goes. Now, in the news, in American news or Israeli news, in European news, this guy he made an attack. He's sick. He's going from hospital for sick people, and he didn't know what he do. He got to shoot. Okay, if we need to believe, he's a sick. We just left the Hebron mosque and I'm on a seat like I don't even know what to fucking think right now. But this is the Israeli take the houses and the Israeli living inside now. The soldier watch everything here. The soldier everywhere, camera everywhere. Just you need to go look. Now the smoke fans start. The dangerous thing maybe the acid. If someone hit for the acid, yeah. this is the only dangerous thing. Who? Who? Sorry. The Israeli living here. The Palestinian living here. This people store stone like this, and you can see 
Now the mom she go to the roof and one Israeli and his name Ofer, he's the dangerous one he lived in this city, his name Ofer, he see this woman in the roof and he think this woman she need to make attack to, to another people and live in the settlement and what he do, he shoot the woman six, uh, uh, six times, yeah, six times, uh, six bullets <laughs> and she's died, died, this is a little bit about Hebrew and dangerous Dangerous? No, no, no. It's not dangerous, but the Israelis don't like you. A mí no me han dicho nada. ¿Eh? A mí no, no se me ha parecido no. nada. No, el sueño. A mí el sueño. La mañana que me levanté, le conté a tu papá y dije, le voy a poner de mano. Tómame una foto rápida porque hay gente, hay gente. Ah, sí.
Mm. Yeah. I'm running out of battery. I'm running out of battery, but we're in downtown Bethlehem. Going to the Church of Nativity where Jesus was born. Oh shit! Oh. Thank you, bro. Guys, holy fuck. This is fucking tough. Oh my god. Thank you. 